6, 1 root of the equation, this one, is 3 times the other root. So, for example, if the root is alpha, so 3 times of the other root, so other root is 3, alpha. Find the value of constant m and the roots. So, here, uh, to find the roots, we know that we have the equation x square minus sum of root x plus product of root is equal to 0. So, from here, we know that the root is alpha and 3 alpha. So, sum of root is equal to alpha plus 3 alpha, which is 4 alpha. And then, product of root is equal to alpha times 3 alpha. So, here we have 3 alpha square. So, from the equation also, we can get sum of root and product of root where we can compare. So, this one we have x square minus 8x plus m is equal to 0. So, from here, you see that sum of root is equal to 8. So, here, sum of root is equal to 8 and product of root is equal to m. So, here we can compare. So, this one, sum of root for alpha is equal to 8. Alpha is equal to 8 divided by 4 which is equal to 2. And then, from here, we can get, this one is the first one, sum of root, and then we can compare product of root. So, 3 alpha square is equal to m, where m is equal to 3 alpha square, which is equal to 3 times 2 square, 3 times 4 is equal to 12, 12, sorry. This one is equal to 12. So, the question wants the value of constant m and the root. The value of m is 12. The roots, so the roots here, we don't forget that we have two roots, which is alpha and 3 alpha. The roots are 2 and 3 times alpha is 6.